Hope gives us wings. The feathers of the wings began with a simple collage of papers taken from daily life, such as newspapers, book text, and sheet music. This collage symbolizes life before one is diagnosed with cancer. They were primed with gesso to form the substrate and painted with the colors intended for the wing design. The next layer is painted with rocks and boulders that represents the feelings that one has when they're told they have cancer, like you've been rolled over by an avalanche. Swirls and knots were then added, symbolizing the confusion one has when first dealing with the diagnosis. The doctor's voice is muted with all the friends and family that want to share advice and support as your head and heart are tangled in a mix of reality and fear. Monoprints were made using a jelly plate and printed on vintage sheet music. The prints were torn and the edges inked and then strategically placed to represent how the walls of fear start to break down as treatment continues and healing progresses. Painted atop the collage elements are white wispy curves showing how much lighter one feels as treatments end and strength begins to return like the welcome spring breezes. The monoprints were then transformed into golden feathers. The feathers are caught up in the spring breeze of wispy curls which symbolize the freedom from cancer and how life is golden and to be cherished all the more with survivorship. The 10th anniversary of the Hearst Cancer Resource Center, words of encouragement were collected from patients, survivors, caregivers, and friends and families of those who have walked the cancer journey. The sentiments give great meaning to the wings. With the love and support of those we love, our survivorship feels like we truly are golden feathers on the breeze. Yes, hope gives us wings. Personally, I found so much hope and love at the Hearst Cancer Resource Center during my journey, and it has been a joyful healing for me to create these wings. It is my hope that they will bring encouragement to new patients and survivors as they visit the Hearst Cancer Resource Center.